author. Teach me how to forget myself. For wilt I think I am thy married wife, and thou a prince, protector of this land. Methinks I should not thus be led along, mailed up in shame with papers on my back, and followed with the rabble that rejoice to see my tears or hear my deep bed groans. <coughs> The ruthless flint self cuts my tender feet. And when I start, the envious people laugh and bid me be advised how I tread. Humphrey, can I bear this shameful yoke? Trust thou that ever I'll look upon the world, or cast thou happy that enjoys the sun? No. Dark shall be my light, and night my day. To think upon my pomp shall be my hell. Sometime I'll say I am Duke Humphrey's wife, and he is prince, ruler of the land. Yet he ruled, and such a prince he was. As he stood by will, I, his forlorn duchess, was made a wonder and a pointing stock to every idle, rascal follower. But be thy mild, and flush not at my shame, nor stir at nothing, until the act of death hang over thee, as it sure shortly will. For something he that can do all and all with her that hates it thee, and Hates us all. <clears throat> and York and Impious Bo for that false priest have all thy bushes to betray thy wings. And fly how thou canst, they'll tangle thee. But fear not until thy foot be snarred, nor never seek prevention of thy foes. Now! <laughs> what? <laughs> On the Rialto!